Turkish pistol shooter Yusuf Dikek has gone viral on social media for his seemingly casual attitude while shooting his way to a silver medal at the 2024 Olympics. The most shared images show Dikek shooting in a t-shirt with one hand in his pocket, a seemingly standard pair of glasses and an impassive look on his face. He's been likened to a regular guy competing at the Olympics, or even a hitman. The 51-year-old is no newcomer, though. He's competed at every Summer Olympics since 2008. Some memes contrast Dikek with his Serbian opponent Demir Mikek, who was wearing a blinder over one eye, a lens over the other and a large pair of ear defenders. Dikek and Sevilay Leda Tarhan won the silver medal in mixed-team 10-meter air pistol shooting and it was Turkey's first ever medal in Olympic shooting. Mikek and Zorana Aranovic won gold for Serbia. The bronze went to India's Manu Baker and Sarabhyat Singh. Unlike Dikek, his teammate Tarhan was competing with large ear defenders and a visor, as well as braids in the red and white colors of the Turkish flag. She was shooting with one hand in her pocket, too. Dikek was 13th in his individual event and is now done at the Paris Olympics. The shooting events were held around three hours drive south of Paris. Dikek and Tarhan made the journey to the French capital, where they were greeted with cheers at the Champions Park, an open-air venue where medalists celebrate with fans. Why didn't Dikek wear more gear? Shooters have some freedom about how they dress for competition. Many shooters at the Olympic range in Châteauroux, central France, choose to wear visors to reduce the glare of the lights or so-called blinders over one eye to get a better focus for the eye which is looking down the sights. It's not quite true that Dikek wasn't wearing any shooting gear. He had yellow earplugs to block out distractions while he shot in the final. They just weren't visible from the angle of the image which went viral. Just like Dikek, Chinese rifle shooter Liu Yukin won a gold medal Thursday wearing earplugs but no blinder or visor. Yusuf Dikek is a Turkish sport shooter competing in the pistol events. He is a retired non-commissioned officer of the Turkish Gendarmerie and a member of Gendarmegaku Sports Club. He won a silver medal in the 10-meter air pistol mixed team event at the 2024 Summer Olympics alongside teammate Sevil Ileta Tarhan. Yusuf Dikek was born 1973 in Tasoluk village of Goksun district in Karamanmaris province. After his primary schooling in his village, he completed his secondary education in Goksun. In 1994, he enrolled to the military school of gendarmerie in Ankara. After graduation, he became a corporal and entered duty in Mardin. In 1999, Dikek entered the military school of gendarmerie. After one year, he graduated in the rank of a sergeant. He served one year in Istanbul, and then was appointed to Gendarmegaku in Ankara, the sports club of the Turkish gendarmerie. In 2001, he began with sport shooting. Since then, Dikek competes in the military national team as well as in the national team. He was educated in physical education and sports at Geza University in Ankara. Sport career Dikek became the Turkish champion several times and is the national record holder in different categories of pistol events. In 2006, he set a new world record in 25M centerfire pistol event at the CISM Military World Championships held in Rena, Norway, scoring 597 points. Dikek won the bronze medal in the 10-meter air pistol event at the 2012 ISSF World Cup final held in Bangkok, Thailand. 5. He qualified for participation in the 10M air pistol men event at the 2012 Summer Olympics. One he also took part in the 50M pistol event without advancing to the final round. At the 2013 European Shooting Championships held in Osijek, Croatia, from July 21 to August 4, he became double gold medalist in 25M standard pistol and 25M centerfire pistol. He took also a silver medal in the 25M standard team event with his teammates Feta Kavruk and Murat Kailan and another gold medal in the 25M centerfire pistol team competition. 7 In the 50M pistol event, he won another silver medal with his teammates Omer Alamoglu and Ismail Kales. 8. 
at the 2021 European Shooting Championships in Osijek, Croatia, he won the bronze medal with his teammates Serdar Demiral and Ismail Kales in the 10M Air Pistol Team event. Dijkek and his teammate Sevilai Leda Tarhan won the silver medal in the 10M Air Pistol Mixed Team event at the 2024 Summer Olympics in Paris, after losing to the Serbian team of Zorana Aronovic and Amir Mikek in the final. In this event, he went viral for his seeming nonchalance and noticeably casual vibe. While many of his competitors wore bulky large ear protectors, visors, and high-tech shooting glasses, Dijkek, at age 51, wore a jersey that resembled an ordinary t-shirt and regular eyeglasses, with barely noticeable earplugs, and shot with one hand casually tucked in his pants pocket. Social media has exploded over a picture of a Turkish Olympic shooter who turned up to his Paris 2024 event seemingly indifferent yet took home the silver medal. With his hand in his pocket and lacking any of the optical gadgets his rivals were donning, Yusuf Dijkak's casual style stood him apart from his competitors in the 10-meter air pistol mixed team event yesterday. Dijkak's success in securing second place alongside his partner Sevil Ileta Tarhan, coupled with his apparent total nonchalance, has made him an internet sensation overnight. Most Olympic shooters use specialized ear protection and lenses to block vision in one eye and reduce glare, but Dijkak apparently didn't need any of that and was just pipped to the gold by Serbian duo Zorana Aronovic and Amir Mikak. Dijkak is no stranger to shooting, Paris 2024 is his fifth Olympics, having represented Turkey in 2008, 2012, 2016 and 2020 beforehand. He also holds several titles from the World and European Championships for various pistol events. He's also a retired non-commissioned officer of the Turkish Gendarmerie, so make of that what you will. Turkish pistol shooter Yusuf Dijkek has gone viral on social media for his seemingly casual attitude while shooting his way to a silver medal at the 2024 Olympics. The most shared images show Dijkek shooting in a t-shirt with one hand in his pocket, a seemingly standard pair of glasses and an impassive look on his face. He's been likened to a regular guy competing at the Olympics, or even a hitman. The 51-year-old is no newcomer, though. He's competed at every Summer Olympics since 2008. Some memes contrast Dijkek with his Serbian opponent Demir Mikek, who was wearing a blinder over one eye a lens over the other and a large pair of ear defenders. Dijkek and Sevil Ileta Tarhan won the silver medal in mixed team 10-meter air pistol shooting and it was Turkey's first ever medal in Olympic shooting. Mikek and Zorana Aronovic won gold for Serbia. The bronze went to India's Manu Baker and Sarabyat Singh. Unlike Dijkek, his teammate Tarhan was competing with large ear defenders and a visor, as well as braids in the red and white colors of the Turkish flag. She was shooting with one hand in her pocket, too. Dijkek was 13th in his individual event and is now done at the Paris Olympics. The shooting events were held around three hours drive south of Paris. Dijkek and Tarhan made the journey to the French capital, where they were greeted with cheers at the Champions Park, an open-air venue where medalists celebrate with fans. Why didn't Dijkek wear more gear? Shooters have some freedom about how they dress for competition. Many shooters at the Olympic range in Châteauroux, central France, choose to wear visors to reduce the glare of the lights or so-called blinders over one eye to get a better focus for the eye which is looking down the sights. It's not quite true that Dijkek wasn't wearing any shooting gear. He had yellow earplugs to block out distractions while he shot in the final. They just weren't visible from the angle of the image which went viral. Just like Dijkek, Chinese rifle shooter Liu Yukin won a gold medal Thursday wearing earplugs but no blinder or visor. Thank you for watching this video.